Hello everyone and welcome to Sunburned Albino Unboxes, a hundred dollars worth of Infinite Warfare Supply Drop Rare Crates. Why? Uh, you know, entitlement, um, boredom, and I'm, t I'm looking to draw an equal amount of curiosity and ire, because this can be a great way to show off all the kinds of stuff you can get in supply drops, and also a way to get people super pissed off at the idea that I would squander my funds in such a whatever the opposite of lucrative is. Let's go. Let's start. I've got 13,000 COD points. That is how many you can buy with $99.99. And uh, actually, before this video, I bought like $70 more. And then it wasn't until after that that I got the idea to do this video, so this has been a very costly endeavor. Maybe it'll pay off, because maybe lots of people want to watch this. <laughs> okay, let's see what we get. Spray paint, terrible. Mountainscape, straight up trash. Jupiter Aurora's calling card. That one looks cool. I'm going to get a lot of duplicates. I already have a lot of salvage. I'm hoping to get a lot more salvage. I want to buy me some epic, because it's so dumb that epic costs 4,000 salvage. I would have thought it would have been two grand. I would have thought it would have been like... 200 for the common, 500 for the whatever's after that, then 1,000 for the legendary, and then 2,000 for the epic. But they're like, nah, we're going to bounce that up super exponential growth-wise. And so I've been left wanting in that regard. Also, I have a mild gambling addiction, and this is a nice way to curb that for a few minutes. So let's... Uh sort of just watch my finances devolve into a very unhealthy situation. It's already happened. There's no stopping it now. Might as well just ride out the storm, you know? Orbit, that's a cool one. I like that reticle. I got the Exile Oni handgun again. I know those are duplicates. I'm looking for the rare... The epic guns that I really want are the Oni epic, the Mauler epic, and... Um, I mean, it's all I can think of right now. I'm pretty sure there's more. That I want. Oh, also the Ravager, the Rack 9 or whatever. I think I would enjoy that. But basically, I'm just looking for as much epic stuff as I can possibly get. And with all these points, if I don't get a single epic gun, what a great video that would be. Wouldn't that be nice? But yeah, I'm seeing the rise of popularity insurgents. Oh, I already have that, I think. No, wait, yeah? No, I don't. I have it for a different type of gun, the slime, whatever. But yeah, people get millions of views on unboxing videos, and this is kind of like, you know, it's like digital unboxing. Plus, it's genuinely interesting to see what I would get because I've wasted so much. Because it's not like I would upload an unboxing video if I spent like $10 on COD points. That would be like a 45-second video. I'd get nothing because my luck is traditionally shit. And then no, no one would have benefited from watching this. But with this, you can, like, see me start to sort of mentally devolve. And that way, you know, as of the sinking sensation sets in, where I realize, holy shit, I just spent 170 fucking dollars on COD points. Ah. But that's, we're good. I already have the Joey head. The Leaf Emblem, 420, all day. Can't wait to... Put that on my shit and make people really disappointed in me. Ah, uh, all right. Tea time, shotgun camouflage. Lopez, synaptic head. Paint streak, I have that one already. Hailstorm Malevolent, now that's neat. That's a nice gun. I need to see more legendaries. Five salvage for duplicates of common gear. That is a bunch of trash. If you get duplicates of higher level gear, obviously you get more salvage, but you know. Ooh, that's not a bad one. It reminds me a little bit of No Man's Sky, which is why I don't want to put it on my thing. But it looks cool. So that's neat. Neat epic stuff going on here. And then a shit ton of duplicates. So many duplicates of common trash. And that's going to be the majority of this video, probably. Type 2 Impulse. Do I not have that one yet? That's great. That's great that I don't have that. You know... It's not all about the legendary and epics. You want to get the rares, you want to get the lines of guns so that you can craft whichever ones you don't have is great. Like, I would love 
getting a bunch of rare guns that I don't already have, just so I don't have to spend 200 salvage up in the line to craft the legendary and exotic variants that I want. So keep on keeping on there. DM1 binary, DMR binary. I already have the Marlin Synaptic Head, but thanks for giving it to me again. I appreciate seeing it twice. Sometimes you gotta see things twice to really see their beauty. That's, that's just me trying to be optimistic about watching my cash monies uh, float down the toilet drain of where I have put them. Oh, that Colossus shotgun camouflage looks cool. That's good. I like that. <laughs> that makes all of it worth it. Not even a little bit. Reaver Elusive. I think I have that one already. That Sandwraith Phantom Head looks awesome. That looks, that looks sick. I like that. And it's only rare. I wonder what the legendary and epic variants look like. Throat Slash, Human Taunt. I hate watching people do that. Watching people, like, they cut their throat as, like, a taunt. It's like, I'm, whenever you do that, I just imagine the blood gushing out. And then I get sick to my stomach, I start vomiting. And then that's not good for anybody involved. So please just, like, stop pretending. My Spirits, Stop It gesture. I've got all, how many duplicates? Are all those duplicates? Not two of them. I guess I didn't have the Stop It. I'm just glad I have over 4,000 salvage now, so that I can buy one epic that I've already cr crafted or have gotten the lines below it. Still no epic guns, and I think we're halfway done. Uh, so I, I'm... Okay, we're not quite halfway done, so we got time. I w if I don't get at least two epic guns, I will be like, this is a waste of time. And how, what's, how sad of a statement that is that I'm like, for $99... I would be okay with two epic guns. That is the the voice of an addict who is, oh, look at that fucking shit right there. That's exactly what I wanted. Uh, the Type 2 is such a great gun, and with the, um, that makes it so that the Akimbo modes fire shotguns. They're Akimbo shotguns. So it's like, oh, could we have Model 1887s from Modern Warfare 2 over again? Probably not, because they're probably like automatic shotguns. They're probably shitty in that way. They would make the epic guns shitty in that way. I've had, I have two epic guns already. I have the, the RPR epic gun, where it's like, you get crotch shots and those are, um, and those are critical hits when you hit people in the balls, because this is a game that simulates very seriously the war and, you know, efforts of the military, of men and women who put their lives on the line for their countries. And so to, you know, properly facilitate that, they give you a gun that does extra damage when you crotch shot people. Because, again, this is a classy establishment, and it is rated M for mature. Oh, that Spectrum V2 camouflage, I like it. I do like that a lot. That's nice. Rainbow, hashtag Pride Parades. Serpent Emblem, that one's neat. Oh, DMR Stimulus, I'll give me all the legendary guns, I want them. I haven't unlocked that gun yet, I'm only level 33, as you can see. I really only play this game when it's double XP, because otherwise it feels like a waste of time. Like, I played the shit out of zombies last weekend, because it was double XP zombies, but now if I played zombies, I feel like I'd want to kill myself. I need the gains. I need the gains to justify the rush, you know? Alright, we're down to 5,000. Which is like thirty nine ninety nine worth of uh, stuff. I'm happy with the Type Two Epic, the Belt Calling Card. The Epic Calling Cards are not good, at least not the ones I've seen. The Belt, I got the Saturn one, which looks like shit because it's just like a laser grid of a sat of a Saturn implementation, and it looks t trash. And I don't know why that's an Epic, just because it moves. Like, our gifts just, like, immediately epic. Like, we just love moving pictures so much that as long as our calling card's moving, it doesn't matter how terrible it looks. Because we're like, we're better than you because our, you know, motion pictures. It's like the difference between portraits in real life and in Harry Potter. Which I actually then agree on that point because all the moving pictures in Harry Potter look a lot better than any still image you could get in the real world. You could do a moving image of somebody taking a pixelated shit and it would still be, you know, like, you know, that's cool because, you know, I'm following the narrative as opposed to 
a standing picture where you just gotta look and like imagine what's happening, you know? Okay, a lot of shit draws here. Draws. I like the. I think I have the E-Rat already. But I like. Oh, I have all those things already because this is this is what I I've, I'm doing right now. Just wrecking my finances. I pay. I got paid seventy five dollars this month from YouTube. And that's all still just my Bloodborne boss ranking video, raking in all the cash for me because nobody's watching anything else. And um, so, yeah, that I just that paid for this. That entire month of views and metrics and whatnot is buying this one video. So that's nice. Like, share, and subscribe, people. I could use it. Oh, KBS Longbow Fortune. I like that. I almost like legendary guns more than epic guns, just because I like purple more than I like orange. Zombie head accessory, that's pretty neat. Not terrible. You can see the accessories relatively well on the kill cams, so it is worth putting one on if you have it. Molten launcher camouflage is alright. We're down to 2400 cob points, we're nearing the end of this thing. And I want to need me two more epic guns. Two more epic guns, please. I want to need that because I've 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 graduated to wanting three because I realized how stupid it sounds that I would spend a hundred dollars and then be like, you know, two guns, two guns is enough. It's so rid this whole this whole thing is so stupid. It's so dumb that this is happening that I'm doing this and that I'm like playing into the entire racket of spending extra money to get shit that should already be accessible to you. Because I have the season pass, too. And all the guns should be mine, but they're not. And they never will be. My luck won't allow it. But that's fun. We're down to a thousand. We're gonna have five more drops after this. It was nice spending this time with you people, because... I mean, it's not every day you get to see somebody just sort of, like, squirm in their seat as they watch all of their cash nice. go up in flames. Those are all duplicates. Two, uh, all dupl I just spent 200 cob points. That's the equivalent of, like, $5. Not $5. Like, $2. I just spent $2 to get all the stuff that I already had. So, say goodbye to that. I might as well... I could have lit a match, put the dollars under the match, or above the match, actually. If I put it under the match, it wouldn't really burn that efficiently. That's great. This is all great. Good stuff happening. There's the Lopez synaptic head. I've seen that fucking shit three times. That's great. That is great. All right, we're nearing the end. My window of opportunity is running out. I like that Titan phantom head. I don't even know if I got it already in this thing. It's been so many... No, okay, it didn't. That looks cool, then. It looks kind of like Predator. All right, last one. Ready? It's going to be three epic guns all in this last crate. I guarantee it. Wait for it. I have that already. I have that already. And salvage. Nice. Good shit. Oh, I don't have the honeycomb for the knife. I have it for every other gun. Why is the camouflages for... Why? It should just be the one camouflage, and then you can put it on all your guns... What, there's like certain types of paint that don't work between submachine guns and assault rifles? Show me the logic on that one. Oh boy. So now we have 6,000 salvage at least. I can go into the armory and craft me a goddamn epic gun that they, would re that they refused to give me. Uh, yeah, okay, so these are the guns that I have. They're the Quartermaster collection. I got all the rare ones. Neat. None of the legendary ones. Yeah, I have the Boz... I have the Bozozoku... Bososoku, bonus damage towards the groin instead of headshot. And stability reduced recoil. This gun's actually not very good. It just actually fights against your urge to go for headshots. Like, this teaches you bad habits. That's, that's not good. I could get... Uh, uh, let me go into the prototype lab. Alright, I do have the butcher. Uh, what epic guns could I buy? I have enough to buy one legendary gun and one epic gun. So do I want the line? I could buy the Epic Volk 
I don't know if I like the Volt Gun yet, though, because I haven't unlocked it. So I want to hold off on that one. The Erad RPR Evo. I could buy the Ripper. I've seen people use the Ripper. I'm pretty sure that's a good gun. It has increased fire rate. Um, what is, I, I wanted the Mauler Mammoth. I didn't get anything related to Mauler here. But, uh, that was, you know, that's the way it goes. I got the DMR1 Legendary, which is neat. Comes with a custom reflex sight instead of a scope. That's nice. The only problem with that is that the damage is 78 on this sniper. That's not enough to one-shot anybody. Why? I don't understand why this sniper is unlocked last, but it seems to be the weakest. Because all the other snipers do, like, 10 points more damage than it. And the fire rate isn't almost any different at all. And its accuracy is a little lower than even this one. I don't, I don't know. This has nothing. I, don't, I haven't tried it, but it doesn't seem like it's better in any way. The shotguns, I was really hoping for a Rack 9 godsend so that I could buy the smoothbore. Or, you know, you could have just, like, given me the smoothbore. That would have been a more effective way. Less middlemen, you know? Fires a single powerful bullet, so it's like that one gun from Black Ops 3. That would have been cool. Uh, I would have enjoyed that shotgun, probably. And it increases the range by a ton. Look at that. It doubles the range. That's a gun that I want. That seems like it would be amazing. I could actually get that right now. But again, I don't have the Rack 9 unlocked, so I want to hold off. I wanted the Oni Kaiken. I don't know if it would be dog shit because its damage is only 60 with the charged powerful single shot. Like, am I really, like, charging up and, like, doing... And, like, shooting that way and then it only does 60 damage? Like, I have to hit someone twice with that? That sounds like trash. Uh, but, I, again, I would have to try it to see. And then the Hailstorm Ordnance might be neat but again i don't have that gun unlocked but anyway this you know that's my uh unboxing great stuff that i got i got one good thing i got type 2 butcher that's the one good thing i got i got the nv4 flatline prior to this video and that infinite damage range is okay but again I'm, i've been using this gun it doesn't seem that much better at all like when are you even engaging people beyond the point of initial damage range so that's neat. You just saw somebody throw flush $100 down the toilet, and then the toilet choked up a Type 2 Butcher, and that's about it. So like, share, and subscribe. Share with your friends. Show, let this be a warning to all of you that gambling uh, will screw you over in the most marvelous way. Uh, but yeah, you know, I'll see you guys next time. I, I, there better not be a next time of this. If I make another one of these videos, shoot me in the goddamn head. See ya!